it's time for Q&A with the credit game. But before we get too far into it, I just want to clarify what a joint account uh, mm. would be, uh, because I am not referring to bank accounts. Uh, a lot of people have joint accounts with their spouse or partner or whatever. And oh, you. Uh, right. Yeah. And, and the reason why is because it doesn't affect either of our credit. Right. Now, there is a caveat to that, mm. because some, what do you call it, overdrafts? Some banks will report it on the credit report, okay. so be careful with that. But most overdrafts don't. So we have a joint checking and savings account, but we do not have any joint credit. Have you ever wondered why? I, I think it's just because you overspend all the time. <laughs> <laughs> we haven't had this conversation about why after how many, 15, 15, 15 years. years of marriage. Uh, it's not because I spend too much, uh, just in case the viewers were, or at least I don't think so. Um, but the reason why is because of the risk associated. Mm -hmm. And uh, we'll go through those risks in a second here. 